They're climbing the towers. Hey, buddy. <laughs> he just knocked you. <laughs> All right, everybody. Baron here, and welcome back to Totally Accurate Battle Simulator. So what we have right here, they're calling the night. Oh, my God. That wasn't even like a contest, was it? So this is what, a medieval swordsman or a squire perchance? I don't know, versus an actual knight who is in plate mail armor from head to toe. And he's chucking the bodies of that guy's friend at him to smite him. So this is gonna be interesting because it's like, how do you defeat this guy if you have to use medieval technology, right? Quantity has a quality all its own if we're gonna Joseph stall in this. Oh god, but I love that he's got a shield and a sword. This is something relatively, relatively unprecedented in tabs. We, we've rarely had units that have, that are dual wielding. But someone with a shield like this, he just went, he just went Jon Snow on him, man. But this is amazing. Oh, he's got, he's got an arrow sticking through his head. You know what's interesting though, is actually crossbow bolts are supposedly pretty good against plate mail, right? Or at least in the medieval ages. The French were known for their crossbows and the British for their longbows. That would be kind of cool. You could have a little, the Battle of Agincourt. And this guy, I wonder, is he gonna be able to deal with all of them? He's doing pretty good. Oh, that's so cool. The armor's so detailed. It's leather on the backs for most of it. And then plate metal or plate mail, plate steel. Oh my God. How's one guy gonna defeat all that? And archers? There's no way this one guy's gonna do it. Unless they add more people to it. Okay, yeah, alright, alright. Just making sure. So, oh, and catapults. The catapults have been revamped as well. So, you know me. I love my tabs updates. And, good lord, this is awesome. We're gonna get a lot of stuff. Like, imagine... Imagine one of these guys in plate mail on top of a horse. Incoming! Hold on to your butts! Oh, that was some friendly fire for sure. I'm pretty sure that clocked one or two of the uh, medieval knights, but I love how detailed the armor is. It's pretty good. Now, I will say this. I think that the tabs... Oh my god, these, these guys have like leather... Uh, leather hoods. And they have arrows. They have little bags of arrows. What are you... Quivers, not bags. Not sacks of arrows, but quivers of arrows hanging off their legs right now. Oh my god, the physics are just fantastic. So while Landfall has been taking their time and we still have no official word when the game's gonna be coming out. Oh my god. At least these videos show that while they're they're kind of keeping things mum behind closed doors and continuing to work on it. Oh my god, look at I feel like the physics are even better. You know what? I'm I'm thinking that Landfall's becoming the new blizzard, you know, where where they're like, you know what? The game is going to be done when it's done. That is just fantastic. So going through this once more, once more into the breach. Now, in one of the previous videos, you guys had pointed out in the comments that the uh, what I thought were knights were actually crusaders. And then you all went on this Deus Volt rampage tirade going on there, you crazy memesters. But I'm wondering, will there be a unit customization thing where like, maybe I wanted to give my guy just armor on his right arm, a helmet and legs, and then hold a big shield, and then no armor in his torso, which maybe makes him more agile, or maybe a little faster, because he's got less armor, but the shield blocks, so it's kind of like a gimmicky thing, but wouldn't it be cool if you could customize that? Like, I remember they showed that off in the past, uh, a more limited version until we, I mean, this is some advanced stuff. Even the archers have these little quivers, like what if, what if you give a guy a bow and arrow without a quiver and then he can't reload and then after it, he starts using the bow as like a club like what if you could do that and his price was uh, adjusted for it I don't know am I why I've always loved tabs is because it just gets my curiosity going right and look at this man the little the, the delta formation here the flying V ducks fly together man that is an old movie but yeah like I really love that armor how how just like well done it is i think they even i think landfall like has somebody that specifically works on that and if so you can definitely see and tell because of the just the, the increase in the detail the fidelity of these models is going up oh but what i was gonna say is i think that these what i was gonna say earlier before the adhd hit was that i think that the uh these guys 
there should always be an element of the tabs wavy armed red and blue guys you know and like that armor covers a lot of it like maybe the visor should be a little bit wider so you see those googly eyes which is just classic tabs you know what i'm talking about oh man these poor guys have no chance these archers incoming i love the catapult effects and I just love anything with a shield. That's why I like hoplites. When they announced hoplites, I was like, oh my god, I've been asking for those for a while. And it's a shield guy with a spear. You know, and I like phalanx because whenever I see this, like, as, as derpy and silly as it is, and beautiful, and just amazing, I always imagine, like, wouldn't it be funny to try to recreate historical battles, but in, like, the derpy, classic, physics-style combat that is tabs. Look at these archers! I swear! The more I, the more I pay attention to it, and that's why I usually like to go over these, like, well, you know, two to three times, is, oh my god, they're just so good. The physics, everything is looking better. Everything is looking better. So good, so good. Alright guys, we're gonna take a trip down memory lane. Fortunately for myself, I'm blessed to say that I have been involved with tabs since pretty much I think it was July 23rd, July 27th, 28th. They probably have an email where I'm like, yo guys, can I get this game? And they're like, sure, man. But look at this. Remember all the little updates? The Chicken Man Man's first appearance? We had the Chicken Man, then there was the Vikings. So these are all like, just little blips. The Ninja Master. The open alpha trailer, oh my god. Like, it's been over a year of excitement. Then the Neon Faction, which is so OP that I wonder if there's <laughs> the butt grabbing balloon man. <laughs> oh, the Da Vinci tank. This is just beautiful. Oh my gosh. Look at that when it went in when it went to UFO. And the, here I'm talking about the phalanx. Oh god, the phalanx formation, the bayonets. Oh my god, I forgot about them. The Napoleon. Oh, and the flamethrowers. See, this is a, the trip down memory lane is amazing. Oh yeah, and the derpy horses. You gotta love that. You gotta love the derpy horses. I still remember, oh, I wonder if they're gonna show the Raptors. First look at the Abrams tank. See, the Abrams tank, they they changed it up. They made it tabsy. They had like little derpy guys and guys with the heavy MGs on the top, the Jesters. What a cool unit. Boom, Mason Chain. This was when we first kind of saw armor, really. The Spearman, what even happened? Oh yeah. Oh, and then tabsy, the totally active battle Zombolator. Oh my God, I remember playing that. The Stone Age faction trailer, all oh, that he kind of like dabbed right there, if you really think about it. And then that the viral tweet is this: how Mammoth actually fought the Banjo unit when really Tabs just started like going crazy. We got the Gandalf unit, which you know the Wizard unit, but we all know he Gandalf. A Wizard's never late. He just kind of came in May 11th, 2017. First person revealed. Good lord, they really are like. They're taking their time, but oh, the Raptors. Cool story about this was I remember seeing a trailer and I was I was in Sweden and talking to Will and I was like, yeah, man, all oh, the headbutters. And I was like, yeah, man, that kind of reminded me like, you know, the first person and the guys running through the f a high grass, almost like Velociraptors, you know, and like attacking you and you're, you're using the M16 to try to try to stop them. And he just kind of looked at me and he had this smile. He had this smirk I'll never forget. Oh my God, the dragon units. He had a smirk I will never forget. The next day I'm flying home from Sweden and my my YouTube notifications go off and it's like, Landfall's uploaded a video. And there were raptors. Oh my god, freeze time's gonna be gorgeous. So it's like, it's so cool to have game developers in a company like listen to the player base to that extent. But I mean, it's pretty good. Oh, <laughs> oh I love that. This catapult stalemate. I wonder how many of those things they have to do. First person ninja, man, that is just crazy. So, man. Tabs, tabs, tabs. I love it. I just love it. I wanted to see crossbowmen versus these knights. I want to see phalanxes. Thank you for being such a positive community throughout Tabs' development. AKA, we're making something amazing, be patient. And you know what, we can do that, I guess. I really love when they do these little update videos. Cause I think, you know, I've always been told and I've learned the hard way that, you know, communication is key. And I think they're doing a pretty good job with that. All right, everybody, look at this. We've got prison guards on the guard towers here. We've got a prison riot here. 
And we've got the police, we got billy clubs, we got riot shields, we got taser guns, and we got, what would this be, I guess? The Tesla coils, where, where would you have? Teslas were tasers? Well, these guys are also tasers. Maybe this is just a super laser. I mean, a super taser, not a super laser. We got the box gun, which is a turret. We got all kinds, man. We got an M16 heavy rifle in there, too. Wouldn't that be cool if you could make them fire rubber bullets and they'd actually bounce off the units? Like, what if they hit this guy and then it bounced and hit that guy? That'd be cool. Or Gungan energy shields. I don't know. But there's a lot of really cool stuff, a lot of cool options. So, I'm, I'm thinking that unless these three units, the leaders of this prison riot, do something... The, I mean, let's just be honest, man. These police are gonna are gonna run rampant. Let's see what happens. All right, a little bit slow motion. We got taser fire. Are these guys with the shields and axes able to get through? Oh, I th I think that guy just got Tesla coiled. I love when I see bodies fly and then they knock over other guys. Look at these spears. The spears are are working. Unfortunately, they have such a slow fire rate that there's not too many actually still up. Oh my God! Wait a minute. Well, these guys are still on their tower. These four, these two jump down. Oh man, the police are definitely gonna, definitely probably gonna win this one. <laughs> he, shot, he got his friend off. He, he just put, he like shot him right off. And that guy, I don't know, did he fall? Oh, he took a spear to the thigh. Look at this. Castle siege. Oh, he took it a musket ball to the face. Where's the other one? Oh! <laughs> I love it. All right. So the prisoners need to change their style, right? We're going to put these boxers over here and we're going to have them kind of bum rush this whole area, right? Lots of boxers, dude. We need to increase the riots. Oh, yeah. What are you going to do about that, police officers? Oh, that's a really good cube. Oh, did that get, this guy did a flip right over the police lines. Okay. Oh, we got cubes incoming, boys. That's going to hit somebody. Oh, and activate. Hold on to your butts. We've got a thermal imploder. Wow. Samurai Master's knocked out. Is he? Or did he just lose his weapon? That'd be so cool if he got up and just started kung fu fighting. Ooh, that's an idea. So what if certain units, when they, if they lose their weapon, which is a very rare occurrence, Oh, I think this is... No, it's not the last one. Get the Tesla coil guy. Yeah! The boxer's still up. Oh, never mind. The Tesla coil guy's dead. Oh. The police won that one handily again. All right, you know what we need. I know what you're thinking. We need the most zealous people in tabs. We need the zombie... Wait, the zombie. The Velociraptor headbutters. Oh, yes. Now, this is going to be totally different. Because these headbutters should be able to get in here. These Tesla coil guys will be able to hit. Oh, yeah. Knock him out. Oh, he was still firing. Come on. Someone's got to hit this Tesla coil guy or you guys are going to have a bad time. Oh, there we go. Right in the cabeza, man. The axe man is up and just trucking people along. What is this guy doing? I'm doing a backflip, Baron. Oh, that was amazing. He got hit in the air. Oh, dude. Can you imagine if you're one of these prison guards? Oh, this is gonna be so glorious. This is gonna be like a movie scene. These guys are gonna pour up here like a zombie plague. You ready for this? Oh, I'm ready for this. Hold on to your butts. Spears are flying in. They're climbing the towers. Hey, buddy. <laughs> he just knocked it. <laughs> he knocked <laughs> Oh my God, I love it. This is one of my favorite moments in tabs, honestly. I need to do more of this. Look at this, he's like, hey, I'm falling down. And this guy's like, this is the worst job ever. I'm tiptoeing on a spear tip. Oh, you're gonna get punched in the face, son. Come on, get him. Boom. Oh, watch out for those friendly fire spears. Oh my God. Red victory. Look at this guy. Like, isn't that the funniest thing you've seen? Oh my God. I want to make, I can't wait, or I hope that we can make custom maps because I want to make like, people could make prisons. People could make battleships and um, Death Stars and like oh, any manner of thing. Your imagination is the only limitation here. All right, so what the police need is they need to call in more box guns. And you know what? Not only that, but they're like, we need to bring in the big guns to shut down this, this riot. We're bringing in Sergeant Suckertash. I don't know. I don't know what his name is. I just know he's a man, a bad mamma jamma. You better not be killing your friends. You're killing your friends. 
You're a jerk, Sergeant Succotash. He's going out there and chopping these guys up. He's keeping, he's keeping, oh, this guy's got a shank. He's got a shank. Well, I mean, I guess if it's a riot, that's kind of like a minor concern. Oh my God, yes. We, oh man. This is why you need a replay function. That guy flew up, did a cartwheel, and kicked that guy out of the sky. We saw the after effects. We didn't see the direct hit. Oh man. The police just shut this down. Oh, that spear missed. Oh, that poor guy. Oh, is he? Did he get stuck point blank? Oh man, it, it's it's weighing him down. Get a cannonball to the face. Oh man. I forgot how how str Oh. Oh man, I thought that was gonna activate. See, but those are my favorite moments in tabs. So, oh, this this suggestion came from Margaret Willard Traub. I think it's some kid on his mom's account, which is awesome, man. Thanks for leaving this comment. Everybody, thanks for upvoting. You guys need to leave me suggestions for battles. There were very few. A lot of it was just talking about, like, we had, like, over 700 discussions happening. And most of them weren't battle suggestions. It was just about tabs. And I think we're going to get a little bit more of that since we kind of had the nostalgia thing. I love these guard towers. But yeah, guys, I want to hear your suggestions for the next battle. Leave them in the comments below. You guys know what to do. You know how this goes. You know the deal. Wait, hold on. Guess what? I know what you're thinking, and that's exactly what happened. The prisoners called in the Yakuza. The Yakuza is here. I don't know if this, if, if their Yakuza leader's gonna survive. Where, where did they go? He's kind of blending in with his little red bandana. And, oh, he took a cannonball to the back. Friendly fire right there. Shoo, shoo, shoo. Come on, Yakuza. Whoa, that's a cube. Oh, you gotta, oh! We just caught that on camera. Yes, he wasn't aiming for that guy. He just happened to be in the way. Oh God, I love this. I wish the, oh no, you are gonna have a bad time down there. You just landed right on a, actually you knocked yourself out from the fall. That's kind of cool. I mean, that's really cool. How many, come on, riders. Riders gotta, gotta store, oh yes. I love it, I absolutely love it. We need to do these towers a lot more. Oh, look at the, Look at the shuriken. Oh, is this guy just falling to fight? Oh, he got, he took a shuriken to the back. We've got one guard tower left. You gotta aim small, miss small. <laughs> oh, look at this. Hey buddy, I'm falling backwards. Oh. <laughs> is he fine? Is he knocked out? I think this guy's gonna get back up and try again. If at first you don't succeed, charge. Oh dude, punch him in the face, dude. Punch him in the face, kick him. Oh, that was close. He's gonna get up. Hey, buddy. Boom! Guard tower is secured. The Yakuza is charging the last positions. And they're dead. And it's just this guy. Oh, he took it. <laughs> oh, he took it right to the chest. All right, guys. My name is Baron. That was another episode of Tabs. This one was a little bit special because we went down memory lane and we kind of covered and went over what Landfall's video they were showing up basically like a summary of all the update videos that they've posted. I think it's all of them. Is it all of them? Were there some missing? I think there were some missing, but it was a great, great many of them. So you gotta love tabs. I just adore this game. And I saw some things in this episode over a year later that I have never seen. I don't think I've ever seen a body flying and then the spear guy accidentally hits it. I mean, there, whoa, whoa. This is interesting. Oh, that one was a miss. Come on, guys. Yeah! Look at that! That guy got speared right in the thigh. The bear man's down there. These guards are precariously close to falling off. Oh yeah, they've taken it. They're having a they're having a dance party over here after knocking out the enemy the enemy guards. But these guard towers are my favorite thing for sure. We need to make a prison map. Oh man! Those spear guys are doing work, and that's a red victory. All right, guys, let me know your battle suggestions for the next video, and I will see you in the next video. You guys are great. Baron's Brigade, where are you at?